I saw you on the last tour when you came out here and you played at Oxford Art. Yeah, that was yeah. fun. I was talking about that show earlier, how much fun that I had at that one. Did you, ex did you expect that kind of reaction from Australia? Or? No, I mean, I, that's the thing. I never really know what to expect. That was sort of like today. I was like, I, I just don't even, I don't ever know what I'm doing. <laughs> like, I know <laughs> what I'm saying. Like, basically, I'm like, okay, my job is to sing well. Yeah. And make sure it sounds good. And then, like, I'm like, and then it just ends up being me. I feel like I'm on display, so I'm like, oh, I, I, yeah, yeah. I get really anxious about it because I'm not used to, like, I don't know. It's not that I'm not used to people, like, taking, doing this or yeah. something. It's just, um, it's just a weird thing. Just walking onto a stage yeah, and not knowing know. what to expect. Yeah, exactly. And, yeah. And you're you're really not, putting yourself out there. I think that's the best way to say it. It, it must be a kind of trial by fire because, you, you know, you, you go from playing in, like, clubs in, in you know small yeah. clubs and stuff and then just suddenly you, you've got to deal with festivals like. yeah exactly so it goes from like clubs to like that's the thing I just never like it's always different in every country or city or yeah. show like one day I'll play for 200 people the next day I'm playing for like 10,000 people or I'm opening for someone and I don't you know it's always just different do you have a <laughs> so mental I, trick that you use to kind of just make every just the get same? through the song <laughs> <laughs> you know <laughs> don't trip I already had that happen once. yeah yeah I think so, last time you were here you were yeah. nursing a knee injury so. yeah 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 so I'm always like don't don't fall <laughs> don't die and what happened did you, sure it what happened right. when you fell like did you, you got quite hurt didn't you like yeah I mean I, I had infections my my leg's been messed up ever since, sort of, like, yeah, I, right. I only been able to really start running again recently, and this yep. happened, like, I don't know, like, five months ago or something. Good excuse so, not to run. Sort of, <laughs> but then I feel, like, gross, you know? Yeah. And also, that's sort of the thing with uh, being on stage, because, like, I don't know, it was different before when, you know, now it's just, like, there's, like, cameras and everything, you know, yeah. it's, just, it's just so different, and it's just a weird thing to be, because, like... I don't know. I feel like there's a lot of pressure as a girl yeah. to, like, even though I don't necessarily want to, like, give in to that, but, like, you know, um, I feel like as a female performer, it's always the pressure of, like, having to look good or else, yeah. like, you're, uh, like, tragic or a mess or something. <laughs> and it's kind of really unfair, but at the same time, like, I try not to think about that or, like, let that give to me, but at the same time, it sort of does. Well, um, we interviewed Courtney Love recently, and she said that she wanted to mentor you. Oh, really? <laughs> so I'm not cool. sure if you want to take her advice, yeah. but maybe she could, Yeah, you know, definitely. Be, be. Yeah, I read this Pitchfork interview where she's, like, talking about how girls need to, like, yell, and I was like, yeah, <laughs> totally. That's what I wanted to do anyways. Yeah, yeah. Um, and uh, so you, you, your album's going to be out for a while now. Are you working on new stuff? or? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just started recording recently or writing and now I'm going recording's a bold term to say I, mean, I just started writing yeah and, right yeah um but I'll be re-recording it within like the next few months I don't know how long it's gonna take I can't like you know it took me four years to come out actually that wasn't my fault that took so long but <laughs> still um never like to give something a date when I don't know or yeah. I haven't really is it, is it, is it, can you kind of write on your own or do you need yeah, to yeah I write I, the thing is like I've always written all my lyrics and yeah. stuff and the melodies like in my head like it's yeah. more like thoughts that randomly come to me when I get like inspired by it but um, you know to kind of actually get it done I usually just go in the studio with someone but I come in with ideas or sometimes like I'm not like opposed to people having ideas like I don't really have that thing where it's like everything needs to be by me because mm. that's sort of how I learned and like it always like broadens the yeah. music by collaborating with people and I think it's so much fun to collaborate with people when there's like no ego involved you know have you had any cool offers of like collaborations and stuff of late or I mean I I've had some people reach out that I wouldn't expect you know um, can you name them <laughs> well like I I mean we haven't really done anything yet like I kind of went this we just like messed around a bit I wouldn't say like, like I um now I just like kind of talk to him sort of I feel like <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm always like worried I don't I yeah. want to get mad or something you don't want to like yeah. yeah but like I um kind of like started doing some stuff with Primal Scream and Bobby nice. Gillespie and it's yeah, been a lot of fun sense. and I it, it's like talk and it's he's really cool um it's nice to have someone like that you know yeah. that sort of yeah like, and, that, and that's somebody who's gonna take like it in a good direction kinda, like, yeah, yeah exactly that you can trust mm. um I don't know if it's what it's for or if anything's gonna come out of it or what but it's cool to have like at least 
met him and Andrew. Yeah. Know. And um, like, what do you think of the whole kind of you know coastal Byron Bay vibe? Is it something that you? Yeah, I get mean, into Australia kind of reminds me of California yeah. in a lot of ways. So like, I was talking about this earlier when we were on the highway. There's <laughs> there was a sign that said Cleveland. Yeah. And I was like, it's like I never left the U.S. <laughs> I'm just like I just have slept a lot less. Yeah. That's about it. Well, but there's a Brooklyn so just outside similar. of Sydney yeah, as well. Yeah, so. that's so funny. Yeah. Yeah. So there's no, that. So do you. you I, I, I think last time you were here, you were joking when you were like, I don't even know what country I'm in. Yeah. The Maybe you weren't joking. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. I was like, it, it's weird because we were talking about, we were like, this is probably like the closest to America. I like, I feel like this is more like America than like Canada. Yeah. People always think Canada is sort of like the other. America, the other but, America. But I think this is, I, I, maybe this is more like the West Coast. Yeah. Yeah, totally. Yeah, there's nothing like New York in Sydney. Yeah, 